Ba-da, 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 ba All right, we are live. Hello, everyone. My name is Crowkit, and welcome back once again to the stream. It has been over a week, I think, since I have streamed last because I was fighting a cold. Yeah, fun times. But as you can see, we are back once again with a slight cough. Um, and we are going to be starting a brand new game today. So we are getting away from horror today, and we are going to be doing some Warhammer 40k bolt gun, which if you guys are not aware of, it is a brand new build engine style game, which is like what the original Doom or the, yeah, the OG Doom is like made from, or at least it's stylized in that fashion. So we are going to be running this and we are going to be having a grand old time. So, as I am loading this up right now, because it is performing first-time setup, because I decided to not try and launch it beforehand. So let's hope this, this uh, takes little to no time whatsoever, which for some reason it is being annoying. Okay, come on, Microsoft, you can do your thing. And... I don't know why this is taking so long to run. Oh, already. Let's see, the little box went away. And we now get to go into our fun time with this. It's been a while since I've played a, a Warhammer 40k game, too. Just until Darkest Skull is barely visible. Oh, I'm actually, I'm digging the soundtrack. Yeah, subtitles are on. Don't need to invert access, looking access. Game has an autosave feature. Notification will appear on screen when game is saving. I just love how stylized this is, too. Oh, God. All right. There's four different difficulties. So there's... Training for initiates, challenge worthy for Imperium's mightiest warriors. Only veterans will triumph. Not even a Primarch could survive. Exterminatus difficulty. Oh my god. I am loving this! Oh. Let's do medium. Let's have fun with this to start off. And maybe. Depending on how long this game is, or how cool it is, we may try to do Exterminatus difficulty, just to see what it is like. Nothing, once touched by the hand of chaos, remains untainted. You are under the dominion of the Ordo Malleus. To assist my investigations into a world that has already felt that fell influence. Grya has been under the close watch of the Inquisition since the Grim Skull War. The Forge world remains largely secure, but we have picked up concerning energy readings in the surrounding system. I have my suspicions, although we have not had sufficient time to pinpoint the origin of these foul energies. 
Well, most of the planet remains unaffected. It is my belief that rogue elements within the Adeptus Mechanicus may have been experimenting with a surviving fragment of Inquisitor Drogon's power source. Your mission is to assist me in locating a fragment of the power source. While I consider this threat extremely serious, your superiors have seen fit to second only a handful of you to my supervision. In the absence of a larger force, we should pray to the Emperor that this does not develop into a more dire situation. This servo skull will guide you. In Commodus here is one of the few sanctified and preserved from the purging of Drogon's heretical archives. Together, you will search sites where communication has become sporadic. Should you encounter any opposition, you may assume they have been tainted by the ruinous powers. Suffer not the heretic to live. Oh my god. While I continue my investigations aboard the Crown, you will be deployed to a habitation zone we lost contact with several cycles ago. You should assume the situation to be extremely hostile. Will do. Beware. We do not know how far the taint of the arch enemy spreads. <laughs> Man, I, I'm honestly really loving this right now. Deployment to Gryah didn't go quite as planned. No matter, secure armament, bolster your faith, and continue. Those heretics don't know what's coming for them. Mash V while using your chainsword to rev it. Cut the heretics to ribbons. Ooh, mouse sensitivity is really high. Let me adjust this. That is still high. Okay, so we have crash landed now, so let's see. Oh, so the rest of my ultramarines are dead. That's fun. Life signs critical, extensive injury detected. Okay. Oh, I can cut things to giblets. I suppose I have to go over here. Oh my god. I kind of want to change this. No, not gamepad controls. Key bindings. Wait, it's right mouse button? Okay, they already thought about this. Oh, I was supposed to go around this way. I wasn't supposed to go around the other side. Okay. Whatever. Leap across the bear with jump. Okay, I already figured that one out.
Oh, is there wall climbing in this? Okay, you can pull yourself up. Door open via switch approach. Engage utility with E. Oh. Oh, so if I hold it, I lunge at them. Oh. Here, barrier is locked and located key. Okay, so I can't break these crates. Speed required, rapidly press F. Okay, so then this is the locked door. <laughs> ah. A holy relic bolter. The Emperor does provide. Oh, so there's a ton of ammo here. Uh, okay. At all times, strength of weapons should be... Uh, just went away too fast. Okay, so the bolt gun one shots small enemies. Warning commenced purge. I'm really loving the feel of this game. I'm getting shock on the Oh, those are all health pickups. Okay. She moved found leave it to me. Okay. Oh, there is a secret in this level. Mountain batteries. A trail through the mountains leads to the habitation zone. Planetary defense batteries line the route. As do heretics. Find a way into the hab zone. Purge any resistance. Hab exterior status invisible. Proceed via defensive batteries. Hmm. 
I did say syrup. Hab zone visible. Advance. Hab zone's visible from where? You're just like eating this dude. Wait, where is it? Alright, I don't want to go that way. Oh, there is an obvious pathway that I just completely missed. Okay. Oh, so that's armor. Okay. The relics are armor. The crests are health. Okay. Hello, welcome back. Almost cat man. Fox man. Cat software running on dog hardware. Er. Is that how it goes? I think that's how it goes. But how are you doing today? Oh, girls exploded in this game too. Oh, that guy took, uh, more stuff. Uh, today we are playing, a uh, Warhammer 40k Bolt Gun. It literally just came out today. It's a, uh, retro style, like, very similar to original Doom-esque shooter. So it's got, like, all the pixel graphic goodness and all that fun jazz. But I am honestly really loving this game so far. Like, we we literally just started it. Like, about 10 minutes ago, if that. Oh, this is throwing a bunch of grenades at me. I should definitely use my grenades more. Yeah, honestly, that's true. It reminds me a lot of um, Ultra Kill with the way that they've done their stylization. we get to just take out chaos marines like that oh this is so much fun No, it's honestly been forever since I've played a um, a Warhammer uh, 40k game because I played the um, the uh, old uh, 
I say old lightly. Um, the Space Marine game when that came out. Like, however long ago that was? I think that was like a decade ago. The one that they're, uh, the original version for the game that they're making a sequel for. That's coming out soon, if it isn't already out. Wait, let me turn this down a little bit. Uh, to be quite honest, I don't know the full extent of Warhammer 40k lore, because there is just a bunch of stuff. But the main gist is it's primarily a bunch of factions, like both human and alien, and they're just basically constantly at war with each other. In all kinds of, like, uh, just graphic conflict. But there's like, there's honestly so much lore to Forham, like 40k, it's insane. Cause it's like, stems from the, uh, like the board game itself to a bunch of books and all kinds of other media that they've made. Oh, I got a secret. Was this just like a, a damage power up? Oh, that's more health. Yeah, at least in this game, the group we're playing as is the uh, Ultramarines or the Space Marines, which are one of the uh, human factions. I uh, just, I just shoot that. I think I may have. Hold on. Yeah, I know, right? Like, I wish I had the... Why couldn't the power-up just be, like, right here at the start? Medical item revealed. I shot in that direction. Uh, wait. Maybe I'm supposed to go up this way? No. There's no way out here. Maybe I'm supposed to go back this way? Potentially? Alright. Where is my chaos? There we go. There's the chaos. At least I heard chaos. Yep. Heresy! Oh, I threw a grenade. I could just charge through people? Yeah, same here. It's like I'm just trying to go where the action is and then there's no action happening. Like, please, guide me in the right direction, game. Like this. 
like environmental stuff to tell me that I can climb up this ledge. Honestly, I love the feeling with this too. Like when you jump, like how it does that screen shake, it makes you feel like a space marine because it's just like that extra oomph, that nice fun weight. climb up here, but I can't go up here. Hmm. Yeah, I know there's medical items available. I have to remember to use this dash more. Can I dash the sides? No, it's only straight. Okay. Leg toad. Honestly, this game is really making me want to just like explore around too. That's a secret. Feel like I can get to that? Uh, no! Okay. I thought I could get to it, but I can't jump high enough. No, maybe I can get to it when I get up here. Oh, okay. Or maybe I can't get up there. Actually, that probably would have worked too. Oh, you know, I'm going to test that really quick. It does work. Oh, yeah, that carries your momentum. Good call on that. Is this limited ammo? Oh, I hope this isn't limited ammo. This is actually really cool. No, it was limited. Oh. I'm gonna turn you into giblets really quick. Thank you, Chaos Marine. Drop down here. Uh, because we are a different faction of Marines. So these guys are the Chaos faction, which are basically, um, 
They're like crazy. And uh, as the name would imply, they are very chaotic. Uh, as we are like the Ultramarines. Though there isn't necessarily like really any good guys in the 40k universe. Like there are some that are definitely better than others in terms of morality. Oh, I guess I'm supposed to go this way. Environmental cues, thank you. Indeed, they have. 95% kills? Oh, we found three secrets, okay. Now entering Sector Imperialis. The streets are quiet, too quiet. The stench of heresy abounds. Looks like the local militarium's defenses didn't fare too well. Send through the hab, purify it as you go. Hmm. Hab status abandoned. Administratum record of workforce disruption absent. Proceed with caution. Are there any funny secrets that are just like right behind me? Oh, I see creatures back there. Wait a minute. Oh, can we jump over this? No, we can't. But there's a, uh, there's a secret there. I see a secret. All right. We're gonna grab the secret once we are purging the heretics. The heretics. Hold on. Just hearing stuff all around. Heretics, where are you? Cause of absence of life signs discovered. Well, yeah, these guys are absent, but I don't see what caused it. These are just giblets. I feel like the platform is going to get really interesting with this game. There's ammo. Oh, wait, this is back where I came from. Okay. For the progress locked. Survivors inside. Query stored. Key required. Okay. Let's go find a key. Jumping into something while jumping, it could launch you using your momentum. So jump into something while jumping. Oh, okay. So use it as like a launch pad almost. Pink horrors. Blue horrors. Oh, the key's up there. Ah! Excuse me, sir. Oh, invisible walls, no! Yeah, it doesn't seem like it works that way. So no, or and maybe it depends on the ramp, because I know when we were doing the launch before, like off of the, uh, the edge, 
it seemed like it was able to carry our momentum and launch us further. But I'm not sure if that'll work in use here. Hold on. Grenades. Oh wait, we're gonna get the shotgun now, right? Shotgun? Ow. Right, how do I swap between guns? Okay, it's numpads. Or I can use the mouse wheel. Oh, middle mouse button is also grenade. Thingy. You know what? Maybe we can apply the ramp here. Oh. I'm gonna shock him, and I can just shoot it. I'm gonna get this. Oh, it's weird. Because it's like almost as if when I hit here, it kills my momentum. So maybe if I do... There we go! So, our momentum carries if we slide off of a surface directly. But if there's any small thing or ledge here, it doesn't. Which is kind of weird. Oh, but now we know how to do that. I think there's another secret back over here. Let's see. At the very least, there's more stuff to kill. Applied physics, yes, of course. Ah! Yep, here's the secret that we saw earlier. Thank you. Munitions boon. What did that do? I think we go back over here. Did I go too far? I'm back at the beginning of the level. I was supposed to go over here, wasn't I? Right? Right? Now I'm getting lost. These maps aren't that complicated, I'm getting lost. <laughs> Yeah, that's the key. That's where we got the key. Why am I not remembering where the door is? Oh, here's the door. The giant red, very obvious door right in front of us. Uh, 
this way. Looks like there's stuff to kill on both sides. So let's just start here in the middle. I need a purple. Okay. All right, you guys probably have my purple. You're in my way. I'm gonna kill you all now. No mercy. And we found another secret. Okay. Oh, it's the cool one. Two deadly factions at war with each other, and one faction decides to send one man to destroy the base of operations. True! Ultramarines are basically one man armies. Yeah, so Ultramarines are uh, Space Marines. They are basically genetically modified soldiers. Um, and they are much, much bigger than regular people. Like, I want to say at least like a Stardis. They're like... I'm trying to remember my 40k lore. I think they're like 8 to 9 feet tall? Like, they're... Like, we're a big boy. Like, we are very, very tall. And I think we have, like... What What else did they genetically modify them? They're, like, bigger, they're stronger, and I want to say that they have, like, two or three hearts as well. Like, we are just a giant walking tank. another guy here excuse me you're not allowed to live here <laughs> man this game is honestly just very satisfying Like just being able to shred through them like that. Like, god damn. Cool, we got health. Got more health. And we are looping back around to where we came from. Oh, that guy just disappeared. Oh, there you are. For a second, I thought he just chose to cease existing from our sheer awesome presence.
We've got ammo full. We found another secret. Wonder how many secrets are in this game. That's a boss. Cause I think it's a boss. Oh, boss no more. I really love that I can just chainsaw anything to death. Let's see if there's anything back over this way. Some ammo. Any secrets? Any secrets to be had? No. I feel like I'm just going to be exploring every single crevice in this game to try and find secrets. Wait, did the tactical bonk go off? Or am I blind? I couldn't hear it if over all of the chainsawing. What, you weren't expecting the uh, the redeem to do that? Oh, I know they are ripped. Oh, you guys can have a grenade. Not gonna lie, that's honestly my favorite one that I made. <laughs> Picked up an all ammo crate. Ooh, there's a secret there I can see. Purge procedure begins! Where are the things to purge? They're, they're not up here. There's not anything to purge up here. It's clear. The fall damage? There, I don't think there is fall damage. Oh, that just feels so awesome. Zone. Oh, I only have six health. Ah! 
Oh no, he died! All right, load last save. All right, there we go. That is our first death, unfortunate. We'll come back with a vengeance. We'll take them out. Have to constantly be running around to pick up health. Ah, oh, there we go. Oh, that's what killed us. It's that dude. It's the Chaos Terminator. Right? Yeah, because these are these are beefy boys. Ooh, they drop health and grenades. Okay, I'll take that. It's always faster to switch to your chainsaw than the reload. Yeah, I I think that's pretty accurate. Oh wait, is there? Another. It's definitely a grenade. Thought it was a secret for a second. Whoop. Whoop. Yeah, I need to pick up help. Come here. Okay. No! I was killed by a pink horror! No! I have to get into the mindset of these games because it's been a while since I played them. Alright. God, what is just doing so much damage to me? Like something is just constantly hitting me for a ton. Oop! Oh, I just ate my own grenade. Wait, do these guys lead their shots? Oh, no more spawned! Oh, I just knocked that. Oh no, I thought I knocked him into the hole. Damn it. I see a gun there, but I don't know. No, I can definitely get to that. There we go.
I think that's probably what was supposed to happen. I was supposed to pick up the big gun. Okay, purge complete. Oh, there's health back here. Well, that's helpful. Hold on, so that's... Plasma? Okay, this is the plasma gun. <laughs> All right. Grab a little bit of health, grab some ammo. Now we can go up here. Indeed, big pew pew acquired. Oh, man. I think we could make that. Oh, is that how I get to this? That's another secret, so... Oh wait, no. This is just where... <gasps> oh, you know what we have to do? That's why that's up here. There we go. Ah, and it's another power up. You know, that probably would have been good to realize before killing everything in here again. Imagine. Ninety nine percent kill. I thought we killed everything there. Alright, Silent Martyrs. The only available route is through the Habs Mausoleum. Tread carefully through these sacred bones. Who knows what spirits you might awaken? Hmm. Oh, Nerdlings! Holy space heresy, Batman. <laughs> the 1% that remained was our sanity. <laughs> True, we didn't kill that yet entirely. Though if we died a third time, I probably would have lost that. So we are picking up a bunch of health. This is gonna definitely turn into an arena. Oh, wait, there's a key. I don't know what the key goes to, though. What? Did I miss? Wait, this is a purple door. No, I don't need big gun for these guys. They are small and easily stompable. Oh, there's the red key door. Okay. And another secret. Hmm. Okay. Ow. 
And another secret. They're really just throwing secrets at us right now. All and are designated heroes of Imperium. Failure to perform revenant and holy rituals at location will be recorded. <coughs> Understood. Weapon slash armament acquisition sanctions. Oh, another shotgun. True, I also think a big bad is coming. Or a bunch of little bads, because I feel like I'm going to get lost and I'm just going to have a ton of guys thrown at me. Plasma does a lot of damage. Plasma rifle does a lot of damage. Uh, let's see. More Nurgles. More Chaos Boys. Cultists. Oh, I am going to get so lost in this area. Okay, we got the purple key. I fell. Oh, that does AoE damage. Hmm. All right, let's go back this way. I'm actually surprised we found that so fast. Oh, okay. And this is the door that we saw earlier. Okay. It's funny how it all just comes around full circle. A snack time has been redeemed. Oh, one. Oh! Actually, I just realized I need to pause. Ah. I do not have my snacks open, so I will open those really quick. Yes, they do all involve hitting the poor fox. All of the red ones are bonks, in some capacity. Thank you for the snack. There's a nice little stick of Pocky.
There's nothing up here except shotgun ammo. Whoa! I was not expecting them to just jump right at me. <laughs> Yeah, this kind of looks like it's getting into boss fight territory. Is this where I came from? No, why do I feel like that this... Oh! Bunch of health there, almost missed that. Is that where I need to go? It might be where I need to go. Oh no, this is where I came from. Honestly, yeah. These guns are all massive. Shrine's located. Heroic spirits interred. Exit below. Will do. Four nurgles. Purge procedure begins. All right, what am I purging? The Nurgles? Oh, you are a big toad. Okay, yeah, there's health back here. Health and armor, let's go. All right, giant toad down.
Well, I'm actually very lucky that there is a medical stash there. who's doing all this damage it's probably all just the really small guys that are just lurking around just chip damaging me all right creatures where are you are you down here There's another big plague toad. Purge finished. All right. Ah, I used all the health items there. Mm. Must find more. I do not wish to explode in any capacity. God, I just love how, like, the entire arena is now just, like, stained with blood and bodies. Like, it's just kind of cool. Exit located behind doorways. Oh, uh, these doorways? Ah, another... Another, another gun secret. Another combat secret that we find after we kill everything. We're just having bad luck with that, honestly. What door is these doors? I'm missing a key. Oh, there's the key. And into more catacombs we go. I actually have to be kind of careful because my health is pretty, or it's low-ish. At least this weapon upgrade makes short work of these guys because it's an AOE bolt. Let's see. More purge. Secret discovered. An actual combat thing that we could use. Nice.
Okay, Plinto is dead. It's nice that we can actually use our combat abilities in combat. Excuse me. Okay, they're still spawning in. So I purged. That's not purged. There's still enemies here. There's still plague toads. How could you deem this site purged? Maybe of heretics, but not of all lesser creatures that are here that are trying to kill us. Then this is the end of the level. Ninety nine percent kills. We got four secrets at least. Onward we go. Now artering. Now artering. Now entering. Martyrs crossing. This bridge connects the hab to the magistrate's bastion. It's been heavily fortified against the, the demonic invasion, but is no longer under Imperial control. Push forward and clear it. Okay. Bridge provides optimal route to nearby Bastion. Imperial sentries inactive. Can we activate the sentries so that way I can have some help killing stuff? Because that would be very helpful. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to actually be up here. Or maybe there's a fun secret over here that we can get. Or not, and we'll just be disappointed. Unfortunate. Man. All that climbing for nothing? Out of my way. <coughs> oh, well, there's a secret over here in the corner. Oof. 
Misuse of Imperium containers is punishable by execution. Look, guys. Take out the pink horror. Take out the other pink horror. Whoa, where'd you come from? Shotgun ammo. Hmm. Oh, there's a little bit of stuff up here. Path blocked. Ascent recommended. Waiting mode engaged. Well, I'm glad that you just want to sit and wait around, bud. That's perfectly fine. And we are ascending even more. Okay. Wait, there's a staircase here. I'm just gonna turn you into giblets really quick there, bud. Thank you. Um Okay, so it looks like I This gets me back up to like two hundred these health kits. But if I pick up the small tokens, then it increases my health over 200. <clears throat> Recorded message. Imperial citizen, gaze upon the great works of the Administratium. This bridge required the sacrifice of over 5,000 Imperium soldiers. Many of their remains were... Okay. I'm guessing that they were housed within the bridge as well.
horrors dead. Take out the flamer. Take out the blue horror as well. I need a red key. Okay. Man, I gotta stop walking into these shots. Here's the red key. A secret. Let's see, vengeance bolt gun. Suggestion lost. Man, I'm just looking at all this stuff, and I just really want to try and climb up everything. I don't know why. There's just something about the architecture here that makes it feel like it's just scalable. Another elevator. Man, we really do like just going up elevators this level. Good lord. have spawned yet? Is that a new gun up there? Oh, that might be a new gun. Let's see, what are you? Heavy bolter? That's why I needed to deal with these flying enemies. Oop. 
Oh, reload. Thank you for the raid. Welcome, everybody. Yeah, more bolt gun. Honestly, I have been loving this game so much since we started playing it today. Have you been enjoying the game so far? Because honestly, this is just so much fun. Because I love retro style games like this, and then combining it with 40k, I'm just like, ooh. Fair. I mean, honestly, I love 40k. I don't know much about the lore, but I have always just been a big appreciator of, like, the artwork and a lot of, like, the animations and stuff that people have made, and it's really just drawn me into this game and, like, other stuff within the entire franchise. See, is there anything else around here? Is there another secret I may have missed? There's a big health pack. And honestly, I feel like they've done such a fantastic job too, like with this style of game, because like whenever I think of retro shooters, like Doom, like very much what this is styled after, like I feel like they just hit the nail on the head with it. With like level design and just the way the weapons feel as well, like they just feel super nice. and it feels like really nice too because you can just swap around with your weapons and each one has like its own nice little purpose that you can use it for like we just got the heavy bolter which is going to be really nice to have against flying enemies or just really annoying ones in general
And I also really like that they put secrets and stuff into the game too. Engage purge protocols. That was actually a solid nade I threw. Nice! Look at that. Still don't get why it's saying the purge is complete when there are still enemies here. The purge is not complete. We have to kill all the heretics. Like that guy. Who was following me, apparently. Oh. And that's the end of the level. Nice, we got a hundred percent kill this time. Now entering Venerable Bastion. The Master Street's Bastion, the information we need will be here somewhere. Now all you have to do is get inside. Shouldn't be too hard. Looks like the heretics have managed it. Bastion appears over on security of fragment data, diminishing factor exponential advocate haste. Oh, how'd you get behind me? I see a secret. Oh. I didn't want to do that. There we go. Now we got the secret. And we have health and armor over here. Nice. You know, I wonder what some of these, like, regular enemies think whenever they see... <laughs> whenever they see an Ultramarine just coming at them, like... Yeah, I could totally kill them. Proceed to get your head chopped off with a, uh... <laughs> with a chainsword. Oh. Oop, I'm in a corner. I need to not be in this corner. 
Oop. Wow, that guy almost killed me. Oh my gosh. Was not expecting that. Oh. One thing that I kind of wish, I don't know if it's a setting or anything, that I wish was a little bit different was that the text box from the little dude talking, I wish it was on the screen longer. That way I can actually read everything that is being said. I'm definitely going to be using the Heavy Bolter against these guys a lot for this spot. Oh, I did not want to jump up there. Wanted to go under. Reach Bastion Entrance. Oh, cool. I can just enter this time. I don't have to climb up anywhere. You know, I'm also kind of thinking about this game with how people are going to be speedrunning it. Because I feel like this is also going to be a really interesting game to see speedrun. Secret discovered. You don't have to tell me twice. I'm going to go deal with the heretics. Where are the heretics? Purge procedure begins. Oh, it's more big guys. Or more flying guys. Exalted Flamer? That doesn't look too good. Whoa! Okay.
just a regular flamer. And cores up there. Okay. Put these guys down. Oh, that's also an exalted player. Okay. The purge is not yet finished. We still have things to kill. Like this pink horror up here. He's just hanging out. See? Now the purge is finished. It's always funny whenever they just randomly come behind me. Just like, I don't know where you came from, but you are about to cease to exist. Let's see, what is around? Oh, cool. Armor and health, I'll take that. Honestly, I'm really glad that you mentioned us being able to launch ourselves off of things because it really just makes navigating this a lot faster. Now there's something, and now there is no longer something. <laughs> there we got a key. Oh no! Aw. <coughs> I have my key. Let me in! It's up there. I have to follow the red lights in order to open the red door.
Goodbye, Pink Horror. Excuse you. Man, honestly, I really... The more I'm playing this game, the more I really want to get good at it and play it and try to speedrun it on a higher difficulty. Like, I don't think I'd be good, but I would love to try and attempt this on Exterminatus. This is, wait, this is where it just came from. Okay. I don't feel like dealing with you. So I'm just going to blow you up with a big bolter. Oh, is there... There is stuff up here. There's also stuff up here. Hmm. Wait, how do I get up here, though? Can I jump? There we go. Missing yellow key. Where can I get yellow? Oh wait, there's another doorway over here. Okay. And there's nothing. You know, I feel like that's probably the natural reaction to seeing a space marine just screaming in fear. Goodbye, Pink Horror. Oh. Ooh. Hmm. 
Wait a minute. I could jump around these rooftops. Are there any other goodies around here? No, that's not a secret. That's just armor. Uh, that's where I already exploded those guys. This is the start of this zone. I need the yellow key. Now, did I miss anything while I was up here, or...? Door equals found. Okay. Now, where is that door? Is that over here? Like, I don't... I don't understand why this is saying door equals found. When did I get the... When did I pick up the yellow key? Did I just run over it and not even real? I may have. I don't know. I have to actually pay attention to what's on my hood. This feels like it's getting me ready for a boss fight. Or at least another big wave. Yep, commence purge vertical. Let me purge the heresy. Come on. Oh, that's an exalted. Okay, big guy's down. That guy's down. That one's down.
up? Where are all the enemies? Come on, guys. I'm trying to blow you up here. dead end. Okay. Oh, that's a champion. We got some armor. Space Marines. Oh, did that say the protocol was disengaged? Oh. Okay. Again, I need to check if everything is actually dead. Basement of supplies. Oh yeah, there's a good amount of supplies up here. There's probably another secret somewhere around here too, but I'm not sure exactly where that is. Exit located. Bastion interior within. All right, we have 100% kill on this done. Two, nice. But we only found two secrets. Yeah. All right, I think I'm probably gonna do one more mission and then I'm probably gonna wrap things up for the night. Let's see, now entering, forbidden knowledge. You're inside the bastion. Its corrupt owner has quite the archive here. Search the deepest recesses of this foul place for information on the fragment's whereabouts.
Ah, oh, my way. Alright, I need purple key. Alright, where can I find purple key? Probably through here. Alright. Wait, do the pink horrors break up into blue horrors? Is that what's been happening? Is that why they just randomly come out of nowhere? Secret discovered. Kraken bolt gun ammo. Item available to collect Contempt Boon. Okay. Where do I go? That looks like death, so I'm probably not gonna go down there. It's just like a maze right now. <laughs> Where must I go? Where? What the heck? Oh, yeah, there's a door over here. Duh. Is 
Those look like uh, plasma energy coils. Red. So I guess that's it. I just take the key and go? Guess not. Alright, now who is shooting at me from there? Here we go. There's a Chaos Terminator there. Me blue horrors. Let me just uh, take this guy out really quick. Get that guy out as well. Nice. Okay. What is this? It's just a cool looking engine room. So I'm assuming they're all trying to path towards me, but I have no idea where they are. Because this is the entrance. This is where I need to go, I think. I'm out of armor. Oh, not a champion. Okay. Ooh, I'm stuck on a wall. Stuck on a wall again. Oh my gosh. Okay. 
Lockdown's lifted, so we are good. <laughs> uh, let's just kill this dude. And I think... Now we should be good to leave this area. Let's see if there's any other armor in here. Oh, we found a secret. So now this is no longer locked off. Oh, yeah, now we can go up here. Got another secret. And another door is open. Is that here already? Oh yeah, this is the main hall. Or it looks like it's the main hall. But this requires purple key. Ah. <laughs> I get red key for here. And then I'm probably going to go get the purple key now. Man, I really love the heavy bolter. It's so good. And more purging. What is this? Oh, that is really trippy looking.
Is that it? Yeah, door's open. Ah, oh, I thought there was another guy around here that was shooting me. Xeno storage. Aberrant entities not logged. Honestly, I really just find it so funny that they just scream whenever they see me. But yeah, just look at this. This texture is just really trippy looking. It's like kind of present anywhere that this slime is. It's just a stagnant texture. It's almost like I'm looking into a void. And more purging. So I have to reach the top of the library, okay. Where do I scale up from? down. Oh, okay. Excuse me, creatures of darkness. I need to go uppies. Could you point me in the right direction? Honestly, I really just love the way that all of these levels just look. There we go. Lockdown's done. Okay, there's purple key.
Okay, we are full health, full armor, and we are just making our way back here. Man, I really just love the fact that you can just slice right through all these enemies. God, that's so fun. Okay, now we need to go where the purple is. Right. This looks like a boss fight. Uh, yeah! Lord of Change, okay. This is like the first actual boss boss. Go. There you are. Ooh, I don't know what I just threw at him. But whatever it was, it did a hell of a lot of damage. Holy. grenade was that that was cool oh i see i have wait i have two different grenades mm. okay so i've been throwing regular grenades most of the time but then it swapped to that other grenade hmm uh, wait, where do I need to go now? Because I killed him. Exit hidden. Oh, there it is. Okay. Alrighty. Did we get a 100% kill? Yes, we did. 
And we got three secrets found out of that. Alright, I'm satisfied. Alrighty, so we are going to wrap things up there for tonight. So, thank you everybody so much for watching. It is always a pleasure to go and play games for you and chill out. So, thank you once again to Reload for the raid and everybody that came in and chill out and just had a good time watching us play Bolt Gun. So, yeah, be sure to tune in next time. We will be continuing this and yeah. So, thank you once again, everybody so much for watching. I will see you all next time. Peace out.